All right, what's going on guys? Try back again here to bring you another video. This one's going to be just doing a quick video giving my thoughts on some of the new teasers for Better Call Saul Season 3 and we got the official release date. It's going to be Monday, April 10th, 2017. Okay, and I'm going to be really careful about this one. I'm not really going to say spoiler warning. What I'm going to say, though, is what I want you to do is I want you to pause this video if you haven't seen the new uh, teaser for Better Call Saul, and I want you to click in the description to see it on AMC's official page. Uh, Los Poyos Hermanos Taste the Family. It's an official promo. They just released it. If any of you guys didn't check it out yet, uh, pause me click that. Okay, so at this point, if you're still watching, I'm assuming you've seen it, uh, 22 seconds into it, uh, man, I just had, like, first time I saw this, my initial reaction was smile ear to ear. This is so cool. Uh, I'm actually really surprised they showed it to us in a promo. So, okay, everyone's seen it now. Gus is back! <laughs> yeah! So, uh, we've been waiting for this one for a while. The episode names for season two were an anagram. Frings back, the first letter of each, um, of each uh, title. If you look it up on the uh, episode guide and the wiki, you can see that the uh, names of the episodes for season two spell out Frings back. And uh, a lot of people kind of speculated that they thought we were going to see Gus uh, return in the uh, season finale for season two, uh, possibly in a scene with Mike there near the end. If you guys remember some of those Mike scenes and everything, it just, it really seemed like that was going to happen. And uh, it didn't. So I don't know if maybe they couldn't get uh, Giancarlo Esposito by that time. Maybe they had to wait to get him. And this season is also being premiering at a weird time. So I'm not sure if he had some kind of scheduling conflict or something. But I just, I was really happy when I saw this promo. I was like, yeah, it's Gus. Gus is back, man. It's really cool because it really brings back some of those, uh, you know, uh, Breaking Bad uh, feels from back in the day that really I haven't had that much with Better Call Saul. I mean, I've been enjoying Better Call Saul like crazy. It's it's a lot of fun as a series by itself. It's kind of like, um, you know, it, it's not, it doesn't have so much of the bad part, but it has, you know, if you want to talk Breaking Bad, you know, the bad stuff, right? Um, we've had a little bit with Mike, but for the most part, it's been focused on Saul, on Jimmy, and his kind of career and how he's a, a slanted lawyer. Uh, you need a criminal lawyer. You don't just need a criminal. You need a criminal right <laughs> lawyer, right? Um, so you know, we've seen some of that, but it hasn't been really bad. You know, a lot of it's not life or death, this kind of thing. And uh, you know, to get to see uh, Gus return in the series, I feel like it gets us closer too bad. It gets us closer to Breaking Bad and what Breaking Bad was, even though we'll probably never have uh, Walter in Better Call Saul, unless it's at like the very end, which I would I really would love to see that. Now that's something to see, like maybe uh, have them walk by at a gas station or something like that. I don't know. But uh, that'd be, and not just like a, not just like a, a clip from Breaking Bad, but actually have, you know, Brian Cranston come back and something. But I don't know. Right now, that's a pipe dream. But, uh, you know, getting to see Giancarlo Esposito uh, reprising his role in a commercial like this. <laughs> hilarious man it's so funny so i know we focus a lot on walking dead i don't make as many breaking bad or better call Saul videos as i used to certainly when uh, breaking bad was on i made a lot of videos for it uh, back in season four and season five when it was wrapping up and was at its uh, prime and uh, you know uh, this one for me is is really a, a kind of a flash from the uh, the past to get to see him come back really happy he's coming back uh definitely check out the promo guys check it out and there's some other ones they've been posting to some of it kind of new, some of it uh, kind of old. You got Saul, he's getting arrested. You got Saul, he's getting a mugshot. And it's going to be April 10th. So this is also something uh, that I'm really happy about because um, April 10th is a Monday. That means that Walking Dead uh, will be wrapped up by the time Better Call Saul you know, airs. So Walking Dead Season 7 will finish. We'll get the Season 7 finale. And this is good. And I think AMC figured this out. And uh, it's smart for them to do that. I think they realized... While Walking Dead is on, everyone's focused on Walking Dead. So having Better Call Saul on at the same time as Walking Dead is probably holding Better Call Saul back. The best way to do it is to put it on after Walking Dead is over because then people can really get into it and it's not just like, 
like, oh, yeah, well, I saw Walking Dead. I'm going to go to bed or whatever. I don't have much more time this week. Uh, people will, you know, have that time free because there won't be any Walking Dead. So they'll be able to, uh, you know, uh, attach that to the end of Season 7 for Better Call Saul and get people really into Better Call Saul uh, again, which I'm really just so happy to see uh, Gus return in the series, guys. And, uh, you know, write your comments below. Let me know what you guys think about this. Are there any old school, uh, you know, Breaking Bad fans still around? I'm not even sure. Now. Like, are there still any old school fans still around for Breaking Bad? That's another good question, which I'm really not sure the answer to that. I think a lot of people have moved on and don't really think about Breaking Bad too much. Some of them don't like Better Call Saul. But um, I'll tell you, man, I've been enjoying Better Call Saul a lot. And, you know... Um, it's really great to have something uh, because Breaking Bad, of course, is, is over for good, you know, uh, with Walter and everything. So write your comments below. Check out the video if you guys haven't seen it yet. And if you like this video, please uh, thumb it up below. Share favorite. Let me know in the comments what you guys think about uh, Gus returning. Are you as excited as I am? That's it for this video, guys. I'll see you again. As always, it's Trav. I'm saying peace. Later, guys. See you.